This is Michael B. Jordan, a global superstar, actor and celebrity. And for a lot of girls, he's a dream man. He has a physique, style, strength, but he's most well known for his role in Creed 3, where he made an insane transformation from building an aesthetic muscular physique. And this is me, I've definitely got some catching up to do. But today, I've traveled all the way to Los Angeles, Hollywood, the exact place where Creed 3 was filmed. So, in this video, I'm going to be attempting his exact diet that helped him get into crazy shape. Yes, people, so we just got to Whole Foods in America, and this is where we're gonna be getting all of our groceries for the Michael B. Jordan diet. They've got so much like natural good products, which is pretty hard to find in America. It's probably like the only place. So yeah, without further ado, let's get into it. So today, I'm gonna to be attempting Michael B. Jordan's full day of eating. And all of this food is literally just one day, not a weekly shop, one day. So yeah, let's get to it. Is so plain. I'm not sure whether it's like an American thing where they have the oats with the water, but back in the UK, a bit of milk, some honey, blueberries, like strawberries, it make it taste so much nicer. But obviously we're doing the Michael B. Jordan challenge, so we gotta roll with it. Now on to the second part of the breakfast. So with this, it's like six egg whites, one egg, and a cup of rice. So very plain again, but we gotta give it a try. You know what? It's not like terrible, but it's just so plain. Like you could just add some hot sauce, a bit of veg, and it'd be a pretty decent meal. But this is like OG, like bodybuilding type meal. Um, but if it makes you look like Michael B. Jordan, then it clearly works. So gotta give it a try. So moving on to the second meal, which is a snack, and we got a bit of protein powder and then the oats. So this is so much better. I'm not sure why in the first meal he didn't have any like flavor or protein powder with it, but this actually tastes like really good. So just gonna dive into it now. Mm. It actually tastes like so much better just by having either chocolate or vanilla flavor protein powder can transform the whole meal. So we're gonna have this, then we're gonna head to the session, get a big workout in, so yeah.
yeah, we literally just finished the workout and now we've got a post-workout meal. It's a, it's a bit of a strange one because it's like double loaded. We got chicken as well as turkey for the protein and then for the carbs, we got like rice, broccoli, also sweet potato too. So it's like very heavy and like a double meal. Um, and obviously with the chicken, we had to season it properly because with the eggs, it was pretty dry. So we got some curry powder, salt, pepper. So yeah, let's tuck into it. You know what? It's actually pretty tasty. Like the turkey is a little bit dry, but it sort of complements the chicken well, because the chicken's quite saucy with all of the different seasonings. So it's actually probably my favorite meal so far. Right, so with this meal, it's meal number four, and we've got a load of fish in there. Turkey again, broccoli again, sweet potato again. So it's like a very repetitive diet that he does, but it's all very clean. I'm interested to try the fish. He did make a slight hash of it. It's not really as smooth as it could have been, but yeah, let's tuck into it. I'm not sure how I feel about that one. It's a bit of a weird one with like fish as well as turkey and then everything else. So it's a bit strange, but it kind of works, I guess. Um, it's obviously good for an evening meal as it doesn't have much carbs. So I can get on with some work and stuff. Not gonna have that crash. Um, but yeah, it's a bit of an odd meal. Yes guys, so we just got back from making the Creed video and I thought that was sick. Like such unique clips going all the way to Hollywood and I always get loads of motivation whenever I'm watching Creed. So to actually do it even like boosted me more. But yeah, returning back to Michael B. Jordan's diet. This is meal five and it's oatmeal again. So literally just oats plus a protein shake or the protein powder even. It's not bad, but I think the chocolate powder or the chocolate protein powder is actually way better with the oatmeal. Gives it a bit more of like, not like a flavor, but a bit more of a taste. Whereas with vanilla, it's quite plain, so you don't really get much of a taste. But that's just my opinion. Yes, people, so on to meal six, the last meal, thank God. <laughs> 
And this is such a weird meal. Like they got shredded coconut on the top. I don't know what that's about. So we've obviously got the chicken, the turkey, the broccoli, not really any carbs, but then we've got shredded coconut on top. Yeah, I don't know, man. <laughs> but yeah, let's get into it. Yeah, I'm not too sure. Like it's, it's a bit of a weird meal. Like the chicken, the turkey, the broccoli is all really good. And then you've got shredded coconut there for like no reason. It's not like terrible, but it's just a odd taste. So maybe remove the shredded coconut and maybe add, you know, some potatoes in there or a little bit of sauce or something would be good. But yeah, shredded coconut, I'm not too sure. So we've just finished the Creed diet. That's officially done. And my honest thoughts on that, it's a decent diet, but it's a bit overkill. Like there's so much protein in that, which is literally not needed, especially for Michael B. Jordan. I think he's around like 5'10", 5 5'11". 5 so there's no way he needs all of that protein. As well as that, I'd also swap out some of the things. So there's so much chicken, so much turkey in there. I'd swap some of that out. I'd like some beef, maybe, or a different type of fish, which would be good. And I'd also add, you know, some fruits, different variety of vegetables so you get all of the vitamins in but yeah overall it's a little bit repetitive i don't think i could do that like day in day out for like months on end not too bad i guess you never really try you know shredded coconut on chicken so that's a first but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed it and yeah in the next part i'm going to go over the complete macronutrients so what exactly was in each meal the breakdown of the calories the protein everything like that and yeah, other than that, I hope you enjoyed it and I'll catch you in the next one.